Morning guys, it's a bright sunny morning. Plan is to convert my rubber band powered boat to electric power and radio control. So we're going to take the rubber band out. Replace that propeller. Uh, probably with this one that was, I've used before. This one's made of a um, spray can. So it's a thicker metal plate than the aluminium drinks can that I used for that. So it'll just be a little bit stronger. But also because it's tin plate, I can solder it onto the shaft. So I'll take this one off entirely. In fact, I'll have to take that um, tube out, I think, because that'll be too thin. Because I'm going to use a bicycle spoke for the shaft. So I have to replace that. Solder that onto there. Cut that length I want. Check if any of these electric motors actually work. And if not, go and find another one. Also got my Fly Sky three channel receiver and a servo for the rudder. Whoa, that sun's a bit bright. Hi guys. Well, a bit of disappointment here. Come out to Warmly Forest to the lake, pond, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I can't remember what the stream's called. I'll uh, float my boat on it. But there's no way I can put it in there. Absolutely choked with duckweed, I think we call it. So as soon as I put my boat in there, it'll just get caught up around the propeller. I think. So what I'll have to do is go downstream a bit. Because there is actually a, a stream out the bottom there. And as I was walking up that way, I could see that was clear. It might be a bit too fast flowing for the boat though. So that's what I'll have to do. Shame, because it's beautifully peaceful here at the moment. Absolutely lovely. But weed. Yeah, no point in putting the boat in there. As soon as anything gets in there, it just gets clogged up. So we'll go downstream a bit. And all I've got to do is try and get down there. rudder works. Okay, we have rudder.
guess the next step is to put a camera on it. We've actually lost the motor. I wonder what that's about. Still got rudder, but no motor. So I have to get down there and collect it. most likely thing is the rubber connector I've used is broken on the motor. Right, let's have a look. Oh. No. Oh. What's actually happened is my soldering has failed. Well, that's annoying. Well, we lost the motor there. And the reason we lost the motor is my bit of soldering failed. Came off there. That's a shame. Still, at least you can see inside the boat now. Receiver, ESC, 2S lithium ion battery. Just a simple little motor out of a toy car. And uh, servo there for the steering. That's it. Well, I shall have to go and solder that back on again. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar 
on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.